Some people who are diagnosed with gastroenteropancreatic neuroendocrine tumors, specifically in the small intestine, can develop diarrhea. Neuroendocrine cells in the gastrointestinal tract are releasing serotonin or a hormone that's making the bowel move things through faster than it otherwise would. If your care team feels your diarrhea is a result of carcinoid syndrome, there are many different treatments that be, can be considered. Somatostatin analogs is going to be the first treatment offered. If that is of limited benefit, they can consider a tryptophan hydroxylase inhibitor. If that is of limited benefit, treating with chemotherapy or radioligand therapy or targeted therapy to control the disease and by controlling the disease, you would then get improvement of the diarrhea. There are other medications that can help manage the diarrhea. Loperamide is one that's over the counter, but there are also prescription anti-diarrheal medicines called Lamotil or cholesteramine, which you can discuss with your care team. Many people wonder what else they can do to help the medicines work better when they have diarrhea. What I typically recommend is that they consider what's called a BRAT diet in order to decrease the risk of diarrhea. Other things that you can do when you're experiencing diarrhea is that you can try to eat smaller meals more frequently. You can also focus on hydration, and if you can, decrease your sources of stress, and that may help as well. It is important for you to share any symptoms, specifically diarrhea, with your care team. It is not supposed to be part of your day-to-day -day with your GEPnet diagnosis. It is definitely something that your team can help with.